welcome back to my channel and happy Wednesday I am filming a video today a super short easy video on what I do for my makeup so I want to show you an under 10 minute routine that I normally do every day it's just super simple a natural look but you still have the makeup that makes you feel good about yourself if you have like pimples and scars and things like that like me so I am by no means any makeup expert but I thought I would show you guys the products that I use I get a lot of compliments on my lipstick so I was going to show you guys my favorite mascara my favorite lipsticks my favorite foundation because my skin is super sensitive so I thought I would go through my makeup routine with you guys I also wanted to say thank you so much I just got to a thousand subscribers I am so excited um, I'm so happy you guys are on this journey with me I just started a couple months ago and it's been it's been hard for me to conquer this monster but I am enjoying every step of it and I'm so glad you guys are following me on this new adventure so thank you so much I just wanted to shout out to you guys I love my new YouTube fam and this is gonna be a great year and I'm just so excited so let's get started alright guys so the first product we are using to start off my everyday makeup routine is a Tarte concealer I am an absolute all over Tarte I think everybody knows the brand Tarte I usually buy it from Sephora all you have to do is put a little bit on your finger and then dab it into your skin over your blemishes it is amazing it covers very 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 well which I love but it's not very thick and heavy and cakey so I definitely recommend using this. It is the only thing I use for coverage. Okay, you guys, so the second product I have to show you is a Mirabella Skin Tint Cream Foundation. It is absolutely amazing. It is a full coverage mineral-based foundation with a water gel formula. It is available in 14 different colors, so basically it matches almost every skin tone. Woohoo! And it definitely deserves a round of applause. It is talc free, paraben free, lead free, and dye free. I absolutely love this foundation so much that I've been using it for literally about five years and I don't even look at another foundation. I almost feel like if I were to use another foundation, I'd be cheating on Marabella. It has been that good to me, I swear. Ever since I've started using Marabella, I do not have acne anymore and my skin has not acted up. I have very sensitive skin and allergies, so finding something that works, it was like a miracle. I love it also because it has an amazing lightweight feeling to it and it also has amazing coverage. It stays on all day long without getting oily. It looks flawless in everyday life, pictures and in videos, so I literally wear it while blogging, shooting videos for my channel, or just running errands. Also for the best results, I would use a foundation brush or a beauty blender sponge like I have on. Woo! Alright you guys. On after I use my liquid foundation, I use a pressed mineral powder foundation from Mirabelle as well. As you can see, I'm almost out of it because I use it every single day. I love it so much. I use this powder to set my foundation, but you can also wear it alone. It has great coverage as well. I like it because it gives you more of a matte finish and it can be used as a corrector as well. It is another fabulous product to use to get that radiant flawless look. I also love Mirabella products as well because they offer anti-aging properties. Who doesn't love that, right? I am using another Mirabella product. Can you tell what my favorite makeup brand is? I don't know if you can tell yet. I love this bronzer. As you can see, I use it every day as well too because it is almost gone. Bronzers are used to contour the face in order to make it slimmer, especially in front of the camera, guys. Hint, hint. <laughs> it imitates a natural suntan and gives great definition to your cheekbones. Now I'm using Tarte again. I love Tarte. This is my favorite favorite blush. It's amazing. I use it every day to look natural but still give you that little little bit of a glow. Another tip you guys, try to keep a different brush for every item you use on your face because if you use the same brush it could possibly become sloppy and mix the colors too much. This product I'm showing you is one of my absolute favorites. It's from Becca. It is a Skin Perfector Powdered Cream Highlighter and I use the color Rose Gold. It gives you that perfect easy soft glow and it looks great. It doesn't look cakey or unnatural. It's perfect in the sun. It's unique and I have not come across a better highlighter. It is amazing. It gives you a subtle luminosity look. Oh, who doesn't want that? You can use your fingertips or you can use a brush. Also, it can be used as an eyeshadow, you guys. It's a two for one. I always use it as an eyeshadow. It's perfect. It gives you that little a touch of pink and a touch of color, but not too much. It's very natural. Yay, who doesn't like that? Eyebrows, I do color in, color in. I fill in my eyebrows, that sounds better. I fill in my eyebrows with a dark brown color just to give them a little bit extra color because I do dye my hair. I dye my hair black. I'm normally a brunette, you guys, so I do like to make them a little bit darker to match my hair. I don't think there's anything wrong with that. I don't do much to them. I just put in a little color and comb them up and then you are good to go. Square them off a little bit. And now I am showing you mascara. I am obsessed with mascara in every way, shape, and form. Like I said, I am a creature of habit and I have been using this mascara from Clinique for about five years too. And it's amazing. It's like having 
a pear brush for your hair but a brush for your eyelashes i have given this product to so many people and i have not gotten one complaint from it i have not found a better mascara normally people use two to three mascaras to make your eyelashes look long and luscious by using you know a smaller brush to give you length and then a thicker brush to give you volume this one does everything all you have to do is swipe up long for length and then on the ends just lightly tap it to give you a more luscious look as you can see the difference right here between my eyelashes it's insane it literally is like a miracle worker mascara i definitely recommend trying it it is one of the best ones i have ever had in my life i do take a little bit more time with my mascara because i think mascara makes your, your eyes pop so it is one of my definitely favorite products i think if i was stuck on an island i would probably only bring mascara if i only had to choose one product mascara just makes you look amazing and then lastly, lips. Last but not least, my favorite lipstick! <laughs> so you have to get luscious lips, right guys? So I like Kylie's lip liners and lipsticks a lot. So I'm using Poise K liner today because it's a matte finish. I really like it. It's just a natural pink color, which is really nice. And I normally use Posy K lip gloss as well, like the matte one, but I am out unfortunately, so I do need to go order a new one. So instead of using the Posy K lip gloss as well, I am using Venom from Urban Decay. Urban Decay is one of my favorite brands for lipstick. This is a bright pink. I wear this color in most of my pictures and videos. I've gotten a lot of comments on it because it does pop in pictures. Everyone can wear I wear this lipstick when I had blonde hair and now I have brown black hair and it still looks good. So it is definitely a color that will look good on almost everybody. And now you guys, I am done with my makeup look. Okay guys, so I wanted to show you guys a before and after. So I did my intro without any makeup on, which that's a little bit hard for me, I have to say. I usually go everywhere with my makeup on and I take all my pictures with my makeup on. But I wanted to show you guys that it is okay. We're all real. We all have pimples, we all have blemishes. And you know, it's okay to embrace that as well as wearing makeup. So now I wanted to show you my after, and this is my everyday look. I just love it, it's super simple. I put a little bit of bronzer on, and my main thing is always mascara and lipstick. Again, I wanted to emphasize my two favorite makeup products. I am obsessed with this Venom lipstick from Urban Decay. Urban Decay is one of my favorite lipsticks. They stay on all day. It looks good on everybody. This lipstick makes you pop. It's good for summer and spring, and it literally looks so good in pictures. I have gotten so many compliments on it. And my mascara. This mascara is the best because it's like a comb. So it's like taking a hairbrush for your hair. Hi, Duke. Look, at Duke's coming here. Hello. He came to join. He wants to put mascara on too. <laughs> um. So yeah, so this one, it's like a comb for your eyelashes. And I have had so many people from 15 years old to 60 years old ask me about this mascara. And everyone always feels like their eyelashes look so much longer and they don't need fake eyelashes or extensions from it. So I definitely recommend this product. It's from Clinique and it's only 16 bucks. And I have literally been using it for four years and I will not change. As you see, my dogs are appearing. <laughs> so I just hope you guys enjoyed this. Let me know, comment below your favorite makeup product. I hope you guys have a good Wednesday. I'm gonna try to post videos every Wednesday for sure. So have a good day and please subscribe, like, and comment below. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I sure did. It was fun. Mwah.